Hello, this is Dennis Johnson, and I'm coming to you with episode number 19 entitled 16th Note Timing Number 2. Uh, this is from the series Drum Exercises at Work. We're in volume number 2, and we're on episode number 19. We are playing basically, um, number 19 is very similar to number 18, with the exception of we're not going to play a check pattern. We're not going to play 16ths before the rhythms. We're just going to play the four rhythms. So as a review, the four rhythms are this. Okay, those four rhythms are going to be played back to back. We're going to play it in a 4-2-1 pattern. So the fours will be played once, the twos will be played twice, and the, and the ones will be played four times. So we're going to play uh, letter A, which will be four of each. say this, the transition from the third rhythm to the fourth rhythm uh, often trips up the younger players, but don't, don't think of it as a separate rhythm. Just think of it as just a flow into the next uh, rhythm from three to four. So you're going... Watch my left hand. My left hand doesn't stop. It's a continuous motion. Uh, the flow, you're not going to downstroke. You're just going to let it rebound and it just flows straight into the fourth rhythm. Did you see that? Hopefully you did. So when you're practicing this, don't go. A lot of people do that. But play with a metronome. Let everything flow. Uh, letter B will be two counts of each, which will be. And we'll do that twice. And then letter C, like I said before, we'll be playing each rhythm once four times. So one time through would be. We can do that four times. We're going to play these, I don't know, down around five inches or so. You can play these up here, you can play them down here, but make sure that you play this entire exercise relaxed and you let everything flow. You don't distort the rhythms, you articulate each uh, rhythm with the same exact um, sticking pattern so it's same, it sounds the same way every time you play it. And everything is just relaxed, like I said, and there's no accent. Okay? So, I'm going to put the metronome at 120, and we are going to play episode number 19, 16th note, timing number 2. Here we go. So that's 16th num timing number two, episode uh, 19 of Drum Exercises at Work. And this volume two, we're playing at one height, we're relaxed, uh, we're using, uh, making sure that we have the fulcrum very precise and focused. We're using our fingers, we're not downstroking, we're not choking the sticks, we're getting a good quality of sound, and basically just letting everything flow, relax and flow. All right. If you start getting up tight and squeezing the sticks too much, you're going to distort the rhythms. So you don't want that. Practice until you can't get it wrong. Okay. And until next time, we'll be on episode number 20, which is triplet timing. So we've done 16th note timing number one, 16th note timing number two. There is a number three, but I'm not going to put that in this volume. We're going to put that maybe in a, in a future volume. Uh, but the next episode will be triplet timing, and until then, keep on drumming. <laughs>